Now, one of the traditional problems in um, ice cream manufacturing is that, um, let's say, 10, 15 years ago, you know, uh, when they mounted the majority of these installations by Hoyer and you know, the well-known engineering companies, that at that time all the ice cream mixes used to be fairly low viscous. And over years, what we notice now is that these ice mixes tend to get more viscous because of market demands. You know, there are more variants. They are more viscous because they had to add products in there. You know like taste and whatever it is, you know, that render it more viscous. And they notice now that the centrifugal pumps underneath these tanks, uh, they can't cope with the uh, increased viscosity that they have, you know. So the ice cream generator is something very sensitive in ice cream production. It has to be fed with a continuous pressure. And this pressure has to be maintained in a very narrow range. And it has to be regulated in a very linear way because of ease of, 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 of regulation. So if you look to that, you're talking about a pump with a closed line and you're talking about a pump with an equal flow and a one-to-one -one ratio flow to speed. And if you look into the available applications, there are not much pumps who can do that. So that's where the mover comes in play. And we've proven the fact uh, in a few factories now that this is a good choice for them. Now the factory we're going to visit now, this distance is about 220 meters. And that of course is another argument that is in favor of the Movex pumps because if you're pumping ice cream over 220 meters, of course you don't want pulsations. The thing is that pulsation will cause pressure peaks and that is something that's very unbeneficial for the generation of ice cream. And again, that's the third argument in, in favor of a Movex pump. And that's how we got the pump in there and by now it has proven its success. It has gone even so far that a second company in Belgium who has the same problem and then they have about 70 meters to cover was invited to that company to see it work you know to show them that that is a solution and now we are busy talking then that company to replace five of their centrifugal pumps with Movex pumps to do the same thing so we try to copy paste this success scenario in Belgium and hopefully abroad well, we are using it because uh, we have uh, we have company and friends also so they are using this type of pump already in 10, 20 years and we get the advice from the colleagues and parents to to test a pump like this so uh, we didn't test it we buy straight away a pump and then we test it the pump it has to be uh, uh, idiot proof it's most important because uh, we are running 24 hours on 24 so uh, everyone has to handle it if it's too difficult for handling cleaning also maintenance uh, then it's a problem it makes life easier with a pump like this that's correct yeah no stress. PSG, where innovation flows.